Hey what is going on everyone this is Jerry Views back with another video and today I will show you guys some really awesome tricks that you can do on your iPhone on iOS 12 that probably a lot of you guys didn't know existed. On any text on iOS you can 3D touch on a word to move it anywhere you want. So you can see I can 3D touch right here and the word would will be selected and I can go ahead and move this word anywhere I want on the text. So simply 3D touch on the word, don't select it, just 3D touch on it and it will move anywhere you want. So you can see basically it will separate it from the other text and you can move it anywhere you want on that text. On the camera app when you bring up the effects you have different effects here. So if you 3D touch on an effect you can see it will remove all the other ones and will just leave that one and the original. So you can compare it how it looks on the original and how it looks with the effect. So you can see here different effects, just 3D touch on any one that you want to compare with the original one and it will show you only those two effects. On the control center you can 3D touch on the timer right here and you can see it will show you this slider that allows you to set a timer directly from the control center. So as easy as that just select here any amount of time you want click start and it will start a timer. On the iMessage app on any conversation you can tap the picture of the contact and you can see right here you have this little icon that says info. If you tap on it you can go ahead and mute that conversation. Basically hide the alerts from that conversation. Click done and now when you go to the list of your conversations you will see that little moon icon right there which indicates that that conversation is muted. The notes app now allows you to scan documents. Of course I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys already know about that. But what you can also do is sign those documents. So if you just go ahead and scan a document, let's just take a picture here and keep this. You can see as easy as that you can go ahead and open the document, tap right there, go to markup here and then just click that plus button right there and you can add your signature and once you add it it will be saved so all you have to do from now on is just go ahead and add the signature so you can see it adds your signature and you can move it and place it anywhere you want on a document. Using the new screen time feature you can lock any of your apps on your iPhone with a passcode for up to 23 hours. So if you just want to leave your iPhone somewhere you don't want anyone to use your apps what you can do is just go ahead and go to screen time. First of all you need of course to set your screen time passcode right here then go to downtime and from here what you need to do is just enable it and then you have here the start and the end. So you can set the hours here where when it will start and when it will end. So basically once you have done that you can go ahead and go here to always allowed. So you have here the apps that are always allowed and the other ones will be locked during downtime. On iOS you know that predictive text is really really awesome and it's a very nice and useful feature. It will basically learn the way you type, the way you say things and it will predict them for you. But you can reset that on the keyboard. So you can basically restart your keyboard from point zero. So just go ahead, go to settings, go to general and then scroll all the way down here to reset and tap reset keyboard dictionary and it will basically delete everything from the memory of the keyboard and you will have it just like you had it the first day that you bought you bought your iPhone. So that is it for this video guys. These are some really awesome tricks that you can perform on your iOS 12 device that I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys didn't know existed. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Go ahead and subscribe for more and I will see you guys on the next one.